Here's the moment for the Abra Weavers. This possession is for survival. Jun Manzo. Bounce pass. Desiderio for the win. No good. And the Pampanga Giant Lanterns will advance to round number two. He's had a fine game offensively. This is a, a very good play drawn out by Coach John Garcia. It frees up Desiderio. Just not there para sa Abra. Heartbreak for the Weavers. It was one heck of a ball game that they played. Just keeping it up. These guys play on the side of Binyan. You have to look at Manalang and Raimundo as your main shooters. Mark Pingris gets it up top. Six seconds to work with. Raimundo on to Robbie for three. No good. And game number one will belong to the South Cotabato Warriors. 82 to 79. So watch Subido out. Subido will push yeah. it here. Step back three pointer. Subido three pointer on the way up to the left. Four seconds to go. Okay, JP Sarao. Ayon natinuro ni Jamal. That's one out of two para kay JP and Paranaque holds and on. This, it gives you still another chance if you foul. It's still a one possession ball game. People are on their feet here inside the Elote Sports Arena. Jeremy Cruz hands it off to the Ant-Man. Jeremy Cruz left wide open. Cruz misses. Rebound to Nisha. No. That's going to do it. And the Binyan, the top down. Hold on to force a game three and extend their season. To get the ball, he engages too. And you look at the man guarding. Was that Peña Redondo guarding Valacuna? A good job of staying home to Val Acuna because you would rather instead of Val Acuna and his decision that time really paid off they had another chance with Joniso on the offensive rebound but he was way off Colombia to inbound Toralba, Cruz Napoles and Cantimbuan there there's a double team on Napoles he splits the double CBC no call that defense four white shirts CBC Ooh, that was close that was close Flores and Palencia Landon to defend that shot Manila Cantembuhan to inbound the baseline Cruz inside no Wow. And that's it. Wow. A comeback for the ages. Check out this final play. Cruz had that opportunity. Flores was there to defend. And a heartbreak. Heartbreaking loss here for Manila. But nonetheless, you have to give credit to Kaloocan. We, we all thought... The leading scorer of Zamboanga in game number three. Renzo to Gabaini. Joseph attacks. Gabaini will miss. And that's going to do it. Paranaque will advance to round number two. Just to get to Zamboanga. Oh. That story of half of the team being in the air for seven hours going back and forth from Zamboanga to CDO back to Zamboanga and back to Manila rebound to Davao De La Cruz has it to Malip now on the right side to Malip treading that baseline Talio from the corner no good rebound to Jexter up in on 16 seconds left Davao has to foul ending even if Batangas wins this one this is a lot of time for a catch and shoot there's a foul? Was there a foul? No. No, no, no. It was just a clear shot from the outside, but that's going to do it. Madanga City. Check out that last play. Misdirection. And then Tomalip that's getting outside it na. outside. Also will inbound. Sino kaya tatanggap dito? Ruka Curva has it. 
Luca Corva drives. This is the layup. Oh. Oh. And that was a good play, Sado. And Luca Corva right here had the advantage against Calvo. Actually discarded Calvo. Oh. oh. And he missed from point blank range. Nabitawan ng bola. Oh, so alam mo yung sobrang libre. And well, well, buti nga, naka, hindi pa nakalita. Oh. And, and Jeremy is on Carlo Lastimosa. Ruka Corva against Calvo. Two seconds. Lastimosa for three. No! And, and South Cotabato! Survives game three. They will move on. And Roca Corva looking to make amends after that miss. Binigay niya kay Carlo Lastimosa. He's had the, the hot hand here in game three.